Yesterday, we showed you the first official poster for the upcoming Bradley Cooper film, Burnt, and today the first official trailer has dropped. Chef Adams Jones, played by Cooper, had it all and lost it. A two-star Michelin rock star with the bad habits to match, the former Infant Terrible of the Paris restaurant scene did everything different every time out and only ever cared about the thrill of creating explosions of taste. To land his own kitchen and that third elusive Michelin star, he'll need the best of the best on his side, including the beautiful Helene played by Sienna Miller. Mark Byers saw this first trailer for Burnt. Uh, I'm going to sell it. I love the cast. I love food. Um, I just, I, this trailer felt like I've seen this movie a thousand times where it's a guy that had it all and then he lost all and he's got to work to get it back and it just it didn't do anything that new for me i get that bradley cooper is a star and he's a fantastic actor and maybe he gets another academy award nomination out of this he's got a fantastic cast this trailer didn't really engage me in the movie i'm not that big of a fan of like fancy restaurants i like chef that movie was great, made me very hungry, but I could go to Morton's or I could go to Fuddruckers. So maybe it's just not appealing to me personally. <laughs> I just didn't care about this particular trailer. I didn't. I don't care about seeing the movie now. Yeah, I, I got to say, I am very by a hair I'm going to give it a buy. The, the trailer didn't do anything to really overwhelm me, make mm. me go, holy crap, I cannot wait to see it. But it intrigued me enough to see it. And we were talking in our pre-production meeting too about watching the trailer did give me the sense of the first time I saw about six or seven years ago a real documentary about how a real New York restaurant kitchen runs. And I remember thinking, this is the most stressful thing I've ever seen in my life. And I think what is going to slightly push me over the edge into the buy territory is that I thought the trailer captured a little bit of that and it made me feel that energy about it a little bit. So it at least intrigued me. I'm not super stoked about the trailer, but just by a margin, I'm going to give it a buy. That's a big, huge buy for me. Uh, I really want to see this movie and I like what, even though a lot of people didn't like John Wells' last movie, which was uh, Osage County, County, which I thought was a really great play put on screen. Mm. And I thought what he did really well was capture human drama. Um, and I think that that's what this movie is. I think that's what this movie's going to be. I loved Chef. It had a lot of comedic elements. This doesn't seem to have many comedic elements at all. I want to see that world. I don't know a lot of movies. You said, I mean, I know this, Mark, what you're saying as far as the structure, we've kind of seen it before, but yeah. I've never seen that really in, in the kitchen world yet in the movies. I mean, everything that I've seen so far. Well, I just saw it with Chef. I mean, it's well, like he had it all, he lost it, and he's got to work sure, to get sure, it back. Sure, sure. But I, I, as far as story beats, yeah, but there's still like the, that comedic element with Leguizamo and his kid, and more. It was, more, it was a little lighter and a little fluffier. There were dramatic elements for sure, but this seems like that we're going for an Oscar here, kids. Now, whether or not they're going to get it or not i have no idea but i want to see and i want to see sienna miller and bradley cooper these two keep acting together they're going to wind up in a real relationship um but <laughs> with I, a fake baby yeah and so <laughs> oh, i actually think that this is a uh this is a movie that to me could really be intriguing that people are talking about so I'm see maybe that like subliminally i was watching it and i felt like they were beating me over the head with the hey this isn't chef we're going for an oscar here mm -hmm. i don't like when i can tell that movies are trying to position it as so dramatic and i get it's really it's really stressful working in kitchens it just didn't leap off the screen to me to be like oh no this is the story i need to see again by the way you were right and the thing about that the doctor brian door yes but the thing was i i the picture screwed me up because i always remember him from one flew of the cuckoo's nest Oh my goodness. That's where I was. Sorry. All right, so the next subject, I got to find out some movies. <laughs> <laughs>